When I think of elk hunting in the mountains, I envision the ultimate goal, to kill a big, mature bull. But as anyone who's ever hunted elk in the mountains knows, it doesn't come easy. I mean, it 
that's tough to say what you're gonna be able to see out there. Yeah, that's tough. This, that stuff's all this tough. Yeah, you can't see the bottom anywhere down there.
closer and closer.
same ball twice then, or is that a different ball? I don't know. Did you actually see him? One. Yeah. You saw the ball? There well, you did. I never spotted him. Good He's ball. Big, big. Oh, he had seven on one side. The other thing is, is you could get over here, but then your thermals are falling down that side. Did you see some elk? No. <laughs> nice try, YouTuber. Nice try, Let's get somewhere where we can check this weather again. Ask beliefs. You can give me those. Just doing the mental checklist before we head out. I think I'm good. I think I'm ready. Raincoat's packed. Bow, tag. Release calls. Everything else is gravy. Last night we were in a couple bulls and a bunch of cows. Um, we think he's a herd bull and we're hoping that that satellite's hanging out with him too, but both nice bulls either way. Um, they're kind of down off this point here, um, down in this area. So uh, yesterday we came in from way up on top and worked our way down. Today we're taking a little bit different uh, angle. Um, it's uh, We might get some rain today, so we're kind of keeping that in mind for what the thermals are going to do. But either way, our plan is to get down this drainage, um, come in. Once we get over there, we'll see if our thermals are rising or falling. Um, and then move up or down in comparison. But uh, we did catch them from the truck this morning on the road above us uh, out in some of the open area. I'm guessing um, just with that ground being damp and stuff, they're just on their feet. So either way, we think we got a pretty good plan. We're hoping we're gonna get back on them today and, and uh, excited to get going, so.
arranged it. At 62, I arranged the opening. He was at like 46. Hey man, hell of a shot on that 62 yard away line. 